Right, the final award for this segment before we get on to main course is the International Education Training Award for Outstanding International Success or Learner Student Experience in the Field of Education and Training. On behalf of award sponsor, the Australian Trade and Investment Commission, this award will be presented by Deputy Secretary, Higher Education Research and International Group at the Department of Education, Ben Rimmer. Before Ben comes on stage, let's have a look at the fight. Good evening, ministers, finalists, other dignitaries and guests. It's my very great pleasure to be here tonight representing the Australian Government Department of Education to present the International Education and Training Award. Australia is an exceptional destination to study, grow and build skills and qualifications. Increasingly, Australian educators are also taking their services beyond our borders, delivering high quality education as far afield as Dubai, Hanoi and Gujarat. This is the result of the fine partnerships between people in this room and between Austrade, my department, and Australia's wonderful educators. And now, the winner of the International Education and Training Award is UIW Global Enterprises. <laughs> Wow, we are so excited and delighted to um, win this award. Actually, I'm extremely proud to receive the uh, award for National Export Award for Education and Training. I actually think that this award is a testament not to the hard work and dedication of the entire UOW Global Enterprises team, but I'd like to think it's a celebration of the transformative power of education on a global scale. I don't know if you know, but education is the ultimate renewable resource. It's the power to transform individuals and nations. It is Australia's third highest export behind iron ore, iron ore and coal, and it's delivering $27 billion of export income to our economy annually. Our vision is to empower futures through access to quality education. Our particular model is to deliver offshore and to be fully embedded in the communities we, we, we operate in, building capacity into, in response to national priorities and agenda. We also provide the opportunity for students to study in their home country or in one of our many global institutions and also in our parent institution in Australia. Our last 12 months have been a year of activity and success, highlighted by the inauguration of a new state-of-the-art campus in Hong Kong, the attainment of university status in Malaysia, we've had record enrolments in Dubai and uh, in, in Australia, in Australian College, and uh, we're successfully planning the approval and we've had the approval of a new campus in India in 2024, but that's been a lot of hard work. So um, we expect the best is yet to come, so stay tuned. I would like to dedicate this award to the, uh, our secret source, which is our 1,200 immensely passionate, highly skilled, capable and diverse global teams. They come from 52 different countries. Um, I'd also like to acknowledge the Australian government, and the unwavering support that we've had from Austrade, DFAT, Export Council, Investment New South Wales, the Senator Farrell, and um, thank you all for your ongoing support. And I would like to congratulate all the winners and nominees in this room. Together, we fly the flag for Australia and are part of building this great nation. Thank you. Wow. So we just don't dig rocks out of the ground. Third biggest exporter education, University of Wollongong was a pioneer in this area. You'd been there right from the very start. Give me one bit of advice for budding exporters. Well, I think you've heard already that having boots on the ground is really important. But the other is, I think, patience, 
and building relationships. You really need to um, really need to work with the people, with the government, with the community, with the business community in the countries you're operating in, and really work to build relationships and trust. And I think to be also really respectful of the different ways of doing business. Yep, here, here. Congratulations, well oh, deserved. Thanks very much.